So now we're going to look at the back panel here and just see um, what our upgrade possibilities are inside. Um, unlike the MSI Wind, which they very much try to stop you from update, upgrading, this is a very simple panel for opening, which is nice. Um, so let's take a look. Well, looks like here's a standard 2.5 inch um, 5400 RPM hard drive. So very, very easy to swap out the hard drive should you want to. Um, in fact, looks like, at least in ours, it doesn't even have a screw holding in place. Um, but uh, real easy. And uh, here is one DIMM slot. So uh, we are going to test this later and see if it will take a 2 gigabyte um, DIMM. Um, but um, actually, it looks like there may be another DIMM slot somewhere else because we had uh, two, it, you noticed before that our operating system said we had a gigabyte of RAM, but this is only a 512 megabyte DIMM. So somewhere else in the system, perhaps under the keyboard, maybe there's another 512, and we, if we pop this out and we put in a one gigabyte DIMM, are we going to get one and a half? If we put in a two gigabyte, is it going to recognize it and see two and a half? Um, we're going to have to find that out uh, later, but it definitely looks like there's some upgrade possibilities here, nice and nice and easy. What we don't have easy access to here are the PCI PCIe uh, slots, where we might say want to try swapping out the wireless or putting in a mobile broadband or something. Um, I don't think this is this would this machine would support that.